um, there were so many faces, black and white squares of shock, fear, pain, incomprehension. I remember a toddler's thinning face, the wisdom robbed from an old man's creases. I remember hair clips, chair backs, smudges, a torn collar, bruised neck, a shadow off to the side and an arm holding down. A rolled up sleeve, numbers on chest, a baby in a mother's arms, a crooked angle, an untied lace, a smile. I walk the lines, the maze of eyes, and I whisper to each that I see them, that they are counted. I tell them to forget that their bodies may never be found, forget what lies ahead of them, and only to remember that I will remember. I mutter this like a hymn, I see you, I see you. And then I see her. She is a 70s clad jolt amid communist shapeless drag. She is defiant, she dares me to see her color. The black and white prison catalog transformed into the colors of her blouse, the brown of her eyes. The only reminder that this is not some dusty tragedy. This is my lifetime, our lifetime. And it began like this. They invaded the city on what would become the day of my birth. While some were wrapped in the woolly cotton bounds of infancy, her country unraveled like so much cheap thread. They rounded them up. A pattern too bright, glasses too clean, fingers too soft and unaccustomed to soil. Feet sent blistering and homeless, throats parched and empty bellies beaten into gratitude. Your memories robbed, raped, caught, hung up, buried, thrown away. Your days a black and white repeat with blood interruption. I have walked over your bodies, tripped through your souls and wept for each bone. Did you end up in those killing fields? With speakers lashed to trees, screaming propaganda so nobody could hear your lungs and stomach empty at the sight of your children lashed against trees, skulls bashed against trees, that thick, large, still standing tree, firm and unforgiving. Does your spirit roam there now, watching tourists with freedom in their pockets, shuddering over mounds, wondering what it all was for? Do you look for your blouse, a pointed collar, pointing color out and beyond and through what your young body never even knew a piece of cloth could do?